uh, the, well, the project actually came into being when the European Commission and industry jointly decided to uh, fund the activities, jointly fund the activities uh, towards uh, the commercialization of hydrogen fuel cells, uh, specifically on transport and on, on station applications. And this project is a so-called lighthouse project. In fact, the first lighthouse project in a chain of, of projects rolling out uh, the, the fuel cell systems uh, and the corresponding infrastructure, hydrogen infrastructure across Europe. And the project here now is the first one is actually next to, to Germany where there is a certain focus on non fuel cell activity, specifically on transport, is the second uh, biggest place in Europe currently where this technology is uh, being shown in daily use. And that's also one of the major purposes. Uh, well, to continue to roll out the infrastructure to be, to remain in, in the uh, places on locations where we are showing the fueling stations. And at the same time, showing that these vehicles are actually, uh, can, can be driven in daily use by normal and ordinary people. And uh, the specific issue in, in uh, Scandinavia is the uh, uh, conditions are very favorable, uh, the financial conditions. Uh, and also we wanted to test the vehicle technology and infrastructure technology in so a somewhat harsher climate. <laughs> uh, so the, uh, in this case, Oslo as the center now for the demonstration, plus Copenhagen, two further vehicles go to Copenhagen, uh, 70 in total in, in Oslo. Uh, this is, uh, well, uh, showing for the whole region of Scandinavia that this technology can be rolled out, can be, can be used. And it should link then into Germany, uh, maybe through Hamburg, through Denmark, uh, to eventually have a, a kind of a continuous rollout of, uh, roll of the technology and the infrastructure.